guys welcome to the pc tips pro and in today's video we are going to see how to add callable buttons in the google sites so before getting into the video if you guys haven't yet subscribed to the pc tips pro please do subscribe and now let's get into the video so here we go with our google sites so let me quickly tell you how can you create your google sites so in the previous videos i have shown in detail how can you create the google site and also have to edit the content have to customize and have to use all the options and all so you can refer the previous videos from the pc tips pro youtube channel and now let's briefly see quickly how to create a google site so uh, you need to go to this sites.google.com and here you can see some templates which are uh, over here so you can use this templates you can select them and you'll be having this template to edit your content like to put your content into this if you are willing to create a new one from the scratch you can click on this plus icon which you can see here so it will create you a blank google site so there you can add your elements and all so it's preferably you can just go with this templates for the beginners so let's say i want this one so click on this so it will be giving you a template so where you can add your own content your own images in the particular way so here you can see and now uh, now we are going to see how to add the callable buttons to google sites so what are exactly the callable buttons so callable buttons are something like uh, which you uh, add a button to your google site by which when the visitors will click on it and they'll be they'll be uh, they can they'll be able to call to that uh, particular number using that button so how can you do that how can you uh, add such kind of callable buttons to your google sites so let's see how you, how you can do that in this video so firstly uh, firstly we need to choose an uh, icon or a picture uh, by clicking on which so we can we'll, we'll be just making it as a button so we'll be making a image or the logo as a button and by clicking on that button the visitor will be uh, taken to the dial option or if it, if it is in the phone or if it is in the laptop he'll be displayed with some other page so we'll see how it works like so firstly uh, let's go and let's choose a, a logo or else a call symbol image so firstly let's go to the so here in the google i searched for call icon so here you can see many icons are displayed so click on the images and you can choose any of this or else if you have your own one you can even click it so we are choosing this icon because the uh, users will be able to know that this button is for calling so let's uh, scroll down and let's choose one of this so let's say i want to go with this so just uh, download this image firstly so now our image has been downloaded so in order to firstly uh, firstly we need to insert this image on our google sites so this is our first step so we have taken the uh, we have chosen a icon for our button and then now we we need to insert that particular image onto our google sites so here in the ins insert uh, section you can see images so click on the images and upload the particular or else like insert the particular image onto your google sites so let's click on images click on upload so now you can see this image has been uploaded and now you can drag and drop it anywhere according to your wish like mostly we will be adding this callable buttons in the footer section or above the footer section uh, so let's say this is uh, uh, i want to add it here or else i have more much uh, other icons too like if i have my instagram handle uh, icon and also my facebook icon so this kind of thing we can create by the similar method so now uh, we need to make this image as a button so have to do this so once you click on, once you go to the insert section and click on the embed here we will be seeing how to add this image in an another way so in the way which we want so let's go to this uh, call, go to the icon like go to the image where you want to add uh, the particular image to your google site right click on it and here you can see copy image address so click on this copy image address so this will be copied and then come back to this embed code on your google sites and write this one uh, type this one open the tag 
img image src equals to in the double quotations paste this after this just close it like this and then click on next to see the preview of it so this is what the image that we wanted to uh, that we wanted to add insert on our google sites click on insert and here you see it so it is looking somehow um, not fitted into this you can just uh, enlarge it but our icon is not supposed to be like this so we, we want it to be uh, look more compatible with our site so we can do that just by going back to our embed code so click on embed or just go and click on this edit section you can see edit and here let's do something which will uh, let's add some css to it so just click on enter and here open the style tag so this is some tag which will be helping uh, your html to style so to uh, this is called as css so let's enter this and then now in the style we will be giving img open the flower bracket and then in the brackets you will be writing display display block and then width will be 100% width will be 100% and then the height uh, set the height to auto and now uh, after this just uh, let's click on the next and now let's save it and let's now you can see that this is adjusted to our icon thing so and even more if you want to uh, even more improve this you can even uh, give it to be instead of width 100% you can give it to be 100 vw so vw is something 100% the width of viewpoint so you can do that just click on next and click on save so once you click on save and now let's drag and drop it here let's say i want it to be here and let it load so once it loads and then let's fix it so perfect this is how it looks like and now let's now see how can we connect uh, how can we make this as our callable button on the google sites so first let's delete this so now so now let's see how can we add this as a button to our google sites again open this edit section and in the image so just let's give a tag called as a tag so in the a tag uh, href will be equals to add this double quotations and in the double qu quotations uh, mention it like tel in the colon and then plus uh, with your country code and you can just give it give your number like this so let me give some number some random number and then so this is my random number and now um, after this let's end this tag with a okay so this is how it looks like and now after you are done with this click on next and then click on save don't forget to close this and then click on next and now you can see the preview and then click on save so this is how it looks like now so let's check this how it works so click on the publish so uh yeah click on the publish and you can give your web address so let's say this my web address is first site google sites and then if it is not uh, acceptable let's like just give some enter some numbers yeah now it's available so click on publish and click on view 
and let's scroll down and let's see so let's click on this and let's see what it takes to so here you can see make a call from so uh, once you click on this button it will be taking you to this new new uh, new tab where it will be asking you to make a call from so it will be asking you to pick an app to make the call to particular number that we have mentioned here we have given some random number so it will be like this so in this way we can add this callable button so here you can see the number that we have uh, mentioned so the random number is like this so in this way you can uh, give your number in this in this place so if you are from india so it's like tel colon plus 91 and this will be your number so in this way you can add the callable buttons to your google sites and similarly you can even add instagram button and also facebook and other twitter linkedin and many more uh, uh, social media platforms callable buttons so you can do this kind of buttons on your you can make this kind of buttons on your google sites so this is all for this video guys i hope you found this video useful to you and don't forget to like share and subscribe to the pc tips pro thank you for watching guys